We don't see any constraint in our continuing to be able to post a, a double digit uh, industry beating growth. Okay. Now, even when it comes to the United States, which is a big market for the company, you continue to remain as one of the top US generic Indian companies. Um, is there any pricing pressure in the United States and what kind of growth do you foresee in that geography? So US had been a relatively a late uh, business for us. Mm -hmm. So in that sense, uh, what was uh, a, a opportunity missed has possibly been, uh, if we now look back at it in hindsight, has been to our benefit that we don't have as much a stake in that uh, market as many of our other uh, industry friends have. Right. Uh, obviously, even within what we have, uh, there had been certain pieces of uh, 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 businesses which were not uh, meeting our profitability criteria. Right. So we've exited out of uh, the liquid business recently mm -hmm. and we continue to, to review uh, our uh, presence uh, in terms of whether does it make to con uh, sense to continue uh, s having that particular product or, or should, should it be reviewed. I mean, so that's constantly the, the threat uh, to ensure that uh, U.S. piece also uh, comes up to a minimum required profitability threshold. Right. Um, back home as well, you know, there have been there's been a lot of cost competitiveness. There's been very strong, uh, you know, pricing power when it comes to uh, the branded business as well, and that has really helped to escalate the company's margins and give a good em impetus to the company's domestic margins. Will margin growth continue? So, so uh, we believe we are uh, amongst the best in class uh, margin at, at uh, uh, our current level. Mm -hmm. uh, obviously, uh, I mean, uh, business would continue to grow in terms of uh, uh, revenue growth, uh, which would be double digit. Uh, that itself would, would generate a, a, a momentum which would improve the margin further. Uh, on the other hand, uh, uh, our last uh, seven, eight years growth, if you look back at it, has been substantially driven through acquisitions that we made. Yes. So we have a lot more room to grow on improving our organic growth and which in the last uh, few quarters has seen significant improvement. Uh, uh, we, we see uh, uh, really a large room to improve and work on our, our reach in terms of our uh, sales force uh, okay. uh, strength that we have. I mean, last some time, Given the acquired businesses that we had, we focused on improving the productivity of, of the, the setup that we acquired. But as that's all behind us, we are working on uh, significantly enhancing our reach. And so that, that itself would, uh, for the next five to seven years, would continue to deliver a, a, a sizable uh, growth lever. Mm -hmm. uh, in terms of uh, our, our portfolio, it's uh, Almost 75% is, is chronic and subchronic space. So mm. that is a, 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 a bigger growth driver within right. the Indian pharma. And so that would continue to help us drive the growth. Uh, we continuously work on uh, improving our portfolio. So differentiated portfolio is a, is a major thrust. And right. obviously, like everybody else in the industry would benefit from, uh, right. which is uh, uh, off patent products and our patents, uh, right. uh, products going off patents. So that also would, would contribute to our own growth. Right. And when it comes to the US filings, uh, can you just give us a little bit of an update? Because that, of course, is very critical to the company's business. What is the update in terms of the H and some of the other plants, the ANDA approvals that are the inspections as well that are currently underway? So as, as you are aware, we got stuck with, with our inspections because of COVID. I mean, it's been almost now nearly three years, I would say, yes. uh, that we uh, submitted our remediation plan to USFDA and then COVID happened. For two years, uh, uh, inspections had been completely suspended, which has, uh, that momentum has begun now. And, and we believe we should get inspected anytime soon, uh, another three months, uh, four months time. Okay. Uh, and hopefully as we get the clearances in due course, that would open up uh, uh, all our pending approvals uh, 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 decisions. And so, so that would bring the US business back on track.